Hey guys, Panzer J back here in Operation 20 Corps. We're up to turn 19.1 for Germany. It is July of 1945. So let's get into the German turn. We'll do uh, purchases first because I'm not going to... Nothing that goes on with tech is going to affect anything. Okay, so we got convoyed for five, unfortunately, last turn. So we got 57 bucks to spend. And I think we're spending all of it. We got our free fort for the Atlantic Wall. We got our free infantry for Berlin. Then we're doing two elite airborne for six. A heavy air transport for 10, that's 16. A jet for 12 is 28. Two infantry for six is 34. Two more infantry for six is 40. Infantry and militia is five, that's 45. And then we're gonna lend lease Italy a strat bomber for 12, that's our full 57. Uh, we only have two combat, so one of them is I'm going to, I'm pretty sure this is accurate. I, I sent a message to the guys and no one's gotten back to me yet, but so we're going to come out of Cyrenaica with our medium bomber, five fighters, and seven jets and come down one, I believe two, and we're going to bomb the rail here between Tanganyika and Sudan. So I believe the only defense that's possible is this uh, British fighter here in Italian Somaliland. I didn't ask Pete if he wanted to scramble, but uh, seven fighters and three jets, I would think he wouldn't. Um, if he wants to, then we can PBE that. So then I should just be able to go ahead and bomb this railroad here. So that'll be the second bit of railroad that we've bombed since the uh, UK turn. I think it just does one uh, point of damage, so nothing going on with that. And then the other combat is we're going to convoy raid, or at least attempt to. We're going to bring our seaplane from Aquitaine out 1-2 to A-28. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. Uh, black for Germany, red for the United Kingdom. Five to two, I actually think we did a little bit of damage, so that'll be nice. Okay, so non-combat. Um, let's go ahead, all the planes that took part in the uh, bombing mission here went one, two, back to Cyrenaica. Okay, so then up here in Europe, we've got... Um, we got to make a card here for Northern Italy because Northern Italy is about to get really crowded. So I'm going to take uh, these guys off of here, set them off to the side. We're going to put them on a card. Okay, so the heavy air transport here in Rome is just going to move up one to Northern Italy. Uh, the two elite airborne in Rome are just going to walk up one to Northern Italy. Uh, four rail moves. One of them is going to be the airborne here in central Romania, railing to northern Italy. Um, we'll get to our other three rail moves here in a minute. Then we got our planes here in central Romania at an air base. They're going to go, and that's what they need it. One, two, three. So that's a regular air transport, a fighter, and a tactical bomber. Uh, let's see. We've got uh, two jets here in. Uh, West Germany, one of them is going to fly down one, two, three to uh, northern Italy. This is the German portion of what's going to be there. We'll have to put that on the card. Uh, let's see. We've got uh, four infantry here in West Germany, so two of them are going to come out. And one's going to go into Belgium, one's going to go into the Netherlands. So that'll give me four each. For infantry there. Uh, let's see, what else do we got? Uh, we got two of our three infantry in Paris are going to move into Normandy. So that should bring us up to eight infantry in Normandy. see what else do we have uh, what's our other three rail moves um, we're gonna rail the two remaining infantry in West Germany and the infantry in Berlin are gonna rail down to central Romania so I had those three guys down there We're going to have this Marine in Denmark come down one to West Germany. 
Our seaplane just flies back to Aquitaine. I think that actually might be it. So not a whole heck of a lot going on. Uh, everything's staying put in the east. I do believe that's it. Okay, so how about unit placement? So we got our free fort and our free infantry. Um, so we're going to put the infantry obviously goes in Berlin, the fort. How about if we go here in A11 in Denmark there? Uh, we got two elite paratroopers and a heavy air transport. They're going to go down here in Bavaria. We got a jet, two infantry. They're going to go down in West Germany. stuff and what else do we got two infantry another infantry a militia okay so the two infantry are going to go down in Paris so that gives us back up to three here in Paris and then we got an infantry a militia and then our lend lease so um, we'll put a militia in West Germany, and then an infantry in Central Romania, and then our lend lease can leave any of our major factories here in Germany and make its way to Northern Italy. Okay, so that should be it. Uh, income, we're down to 54, so not so good. We do still have our six bonuses, uh, three for Romania and three for Sweden, so that's 60 bucks next turn. Okay, let's do a unit recap. We'll just go through everything in its entirety, even the territories that didn't change. So, okay, here in uh, Lebelski, we've got 15 infantry, uh, three SS Panzer Grenadiers, two medium armor, two Tigers, and four advanced mechs. Uh, Konisberg has a militia. Warsaw has a militia and infantry. East Poland has... 15 infantry, 13 advanced max, 2 medium armor, or no, 3 medium armor. Bessarabia militia, Yugoslavia militia, Bulgaria militia, Central Romania militia, and 4, 8 infantry. Uh, East Germany is an infantry. Uh, Berlin is two militia and an infantry. Bavaria is two elite paratroopers and infantry in a heavy air transport. West Germany is two infantry, a marine, a militia, two jets, and a fighter. Uh, Denmark is a militia and four Italian infantry. Belgium and the Netherlands are four infantry and a militia apiece. Uh, Alsace-Lorraine is an infantry. Paris is three infantry and three jets. Uh, Picardy is two infantry, a militia, a light armor, uh, two medium armor, three SS Panzer Grenadiers, and five advanced mechs. Normandy is eight infantry, a militia, an AA gun, two advanced mechs, uh, SS Panzer Grenadier. Aquitaine is eight infantry, uh, AA gun. German and Italian seaplane. Uh, Rome for the Germans is two motorized infantry, two uh, infantry, and three self-propelled artillery. Cyrenaica didn't change. It's the medium bomb for Germany. It's the medium bomber, the infantry, the three jets, and the seven fighters. And then finally in northern Italy, uh, Italy has a militia, a heavy armor, six infantry, and now the newly lend lease strat bomber. And Germany has uh, two jets, 
a fighter, a tactical bomber, a regular air transport, a heavy air transport, two SS Panzer Grenadiers, a medium armor, and three elite airborne. So that should be it for uh, Germany here on turn number 19. Turning things over now to Silk in the USSR CCP.